My name is Ian Matika and I am the Grade 1 teacher here at Ningbo. Teaching is in the family, so my mum is in education and we have family friends that work in education. When I was at college, I'd like to work with children, so I took the plunge and got into teaching. Start to write your Yes. I was offered a few other jobs internationally, but I came to Ningbo because it seemed quite a small city in comparison to other Chinese cities. The way the city looked, it was quite green. Teaching the Grade 1 students has been a learning curve in the fact that not only is it teaching younger children, but teaching children that are English as an additional language. It's beneficial to be in a bilingual environment. It opens up more opportunities for them. Being in a bilingual setting not only allows them to have that opportunity overseas, but also within their own country. I think they get the best of both worlds in some respects. They have good education in, in Chinese, but also within an English medium as well. Caterpillar. And what does a caterpillar turn into? It's butterfly. butterfly. One language sets you in a corridor, but more languages will help you open more doors. This is why we implement bilingual education in Nas Ningbo. Here, the Chinese teachers and the expert teachers, they work together to give the students more chances to think critically. It really benefits students in both sides. The students will have a lot of chances to be involved in the full English environment lessons. I'm definitely glad that I made the jump to go and teach internationally. I think the idea of travelling, seeing things, is something that really appeals to me. Experiencing different cultures, going to different countries, you know, just seeing the world and seeing what's out there. Teaching's rewarding because you have those days where all of a sudden something clicks and the children understand something and you see the progress that they make. Especially here, being in a bilingual school where the children didn't speak a lot of English when they first arrived, you see them picking it up, they're starting to read, they're starting to write and start to speak in English. And knowing that I'm the one that's facilitated that and enabled that to happen is, for me, that's rewarded. <laughs>